Perhaps we want to go in and actually add some physical borders between the edge of our page and our text. In this video, we'll look at how we can set that up. To add borders to my page, I have to come here under the Page Layout tab on the ribbon. And you can see under the Page Background chunk, I have Page Borders. And if I click on that, it's going to launch a dialog box called the Border and Shading dialog box. And here I can see my page borders, and this is the tab I'm interested in. On the right hand side, I get basically a little kind of preview of my document, and I get these buttons, and these buttons will let me add a border to say the top by clicking on it. If I click that button again, it takes the border off. Or I can add them to the bottom, the left, the right, or I can mix them to add borders all the way around, or maybe just the left and the right. And these are just doing regular solid borders. And here I can see in this drop down menu where it says apply to, I can choose to apply it to my whole document, or I can go section by section and give them their own borders. I'm just going to choose whole document. And I'm just going to say OK. And here you can see on my page on the left and right, I'm getting those solid borders. But we can customize the borders a bit more. If I go back to page borders, I can come in here and I'm just going to turn these borders off that I added. And here in the middle, I've got these styles. And I can choose a different kind of line. Maybe I like this dashed line. I can choose that. And maybe I want a different color. I can choose that here. And maybe I want a different width for my lines. I'll choose that here. Maybe three points. And I can come back over my preview here. And now as I add lines, it adds this new style that I just set up. I add one maybe to the top and the bottom. And I can press OK. And there my lines show up again. I'll go back here to Page Borders. Again, to turn those off, I can click there and click there. There's also here at the bottom something called Art. And if I use the drop down menu, I get all of these artistic sort of picture style borders. I'll choose the one I want. And again, I can control where they're going to show up on my page. Perhaps I like them all the way around like that. And I'll press OK. And there the borders get applied all the way around my page. So there you have page borders. Now if you're using sections inside your document, keep in mind you can tell Word to have borders in certain sections that are different from the other sections in your document.